There's a tree that is so dangerous that even standing beneath its branches can be fatal. John Allen Chow, 27 years old, was reportedly killed by the tribes of uh, St. Denis community. And I traveled to Death Valley for a first-hand look at the destruction and how this storm has reshaped this popular spot for visitors. There are crystals that are huge, so big you can actually walk across them. Irrespective of how much you love traveling, some places around the world are just off limits. From seemingly serene landscapes to hidden dangers lurking beneath the surface, prepare to be astonished by the chilling tales that unfold in each entry. The Sentinelese residing on North Sentinel Island in the Andaman Archipelago are one of the last uncontacted tribes on Earth. Their isolation stems from a desire to remain disconnected from the outside world, maintaining a hunter-gatherer lifestyle. While this isolation has preserved their unique culture, it also makes any contact potentially unsafe. The Sentinelese vehemently resist outsiders, often responding with hostility. Attempting contact poses risks to both the tribe and outsiders, as the Sentinelese lack immunity to common diseases. The Indian government enforces a strict no-contact policy to protect their well-being and preserve their cultural autonomy. Venturing close is not just risky, it's a direct violation of their wishes and a threat to their existence. They are a very lively people who prefer to live in isolation. Bermuda Triangle. The Bermuda Triangle, also known as the Devil's Triangle, is a loosely defined region in the western part of the North Atlantic Ocean. It forms a triangle with vertices in Miami, Bermuda, and Puerto Rico. While the concept of the Bermuda Triangle is more myth than science, it gained notoriety due to reports of mysterious disappearances of ships and aircraft. This appearance of the ship has been one of the most baffling mysteries in the annals of the Navy. Some theories suggest magnetic anomalies, underwater features, or human air, but no conclusive evidence supports these claims. Regardless of the scientific scrutiny, the Bermuda Triangle has earned a reputation for its eerie mysteries. Time more and more people started noticing. There have been other disappearances in this backyard sea of ours. Contributing to its allure and sparking the imagination of those intrigued by the unknown. Solari di Yuani. Solari di Yuani, the largest salt flat in the world, is situated in Bolivia and spans more than 10,000 square kilometers. During the rainy season, this natural wonder imitates a mirror that reflects the sky so flawlessly that it's difficult to tell heaven from earth. The depth perception here, because it's so flat, is so messed up. There are, however, risks associated with this intriguing mirror phenomenon. Deceptively smooth, the thin layer of water hides dangers such as sinkholes or fissures in the salt crust. It is important to exercise caution when navigating the Salar, since its mirrored surface may be confusing and easily cause one to lose their sense of direction. Death Valley and Death Valley National Park remains closed after being hit by the remnants of Tropical Storm Hillary. Death Valley, California, USA holds the title of the hottest place on Earth. With temperatures soaring above 130 degrees Fahrenheit, 54 degrees Celsius, it's a scorching expanse of extremes. Beyond its blistering heat, Death Valley is also known for its unique landscapes, featuring salt flats, rugged mountains, and mysterious sailing stones. Despite its enchanting beauty, the valley poses significant dangers. The extreme temperatures can lead to heat-related illnesses, and water sources are scarce. The remote terrain makes rescue difficult, emphasizing the importance of preparation. Venturing into Death Valley requires ample water and a keen awareness of the challenging conditions that define this awe-inspiring yet grievous desert. Trail of Death Love hiking? I think you'll change your mind after watching this next clip. Mount Hushan is famous for the hiking trail known as the Trail of Death. Many tourists call it the most dangerous hiking trail in the world because of its narrow passes made only of wooden planks and carved rock faces. Besides the rusty chain handles and the worn wooden pass, the biggest danger to safety is often the overcrowding during the summer season because Mount Hushan has been a place of religious importance since at least the 2nd century BCE. 
when a Taoist temple was established at its base. Talk about dedication to religion. Valley of Death, Russia The Soviet Valley of Death lies deep within Russia's Ural Mountains. This place is notorious for reports of unexplained phenomena, strange disappearances, and the discovery of ancient skeletons scattered across the area. These skeletal remains, believed to be from a medieval civilization, add a chilling layer to the valley's mystique. The danger lies not just in the tales, but in the unexplained presence of these skeletons, sparking debates among archaeologists and fueling the valley's ominous reputation. Whether you're a thrill seeker or a skeptic, the Valley of Death is undeniably a place where reality and folklore converge in an unsettling way. Nyaka Crystal Cave under the Mexican desert, Nyaka Crystal Cave is a subterranean paradise home to enormous selenite crystals. There are crystals that are huge, so big you can actually walk across them. Some of which reach a length of 39 feet. While captivating, this geological marvel poses risks that rival its beauty. Temperatures soar to a scorching 136 degrees Fahrenheit, 58 degrees Celsius, and humidity hovers near 100%, creating an otherworldly environment around the world to see some of the most amazing geology but this place. The treacherous conditions demand specialized gear, including cooling suits to protect explorers from heat stroke and dehydration. The immense crystals, fragile as glass, also pose physical dangers. Crystals are the most orderly structure in nature. With the potential for collapse or injury, despite its dangers, the allure of Nayaka Crystal Cave continues to draw intrepid explorers, offering a rare glimpse into the Earth's spectacular and risky depths. Snake Island Snake Island, officially known as Lahi da Cuamada Grande, is a small enigmatic landmass located off the coast of Brazil. Don't be fooled by its scenic view as the place is infamous for its threatening reputation. The island is home to the Golden Lancehead Pit Viper, one of the world's deadliest snakes. With no natural predators, these serpents have multiplied, making every step a potential encounter with danger. With little to no possibility of treatment, the risk of fatality is quite high. Consequently, since Snake Island is cut off from most of the world due to rising water levels, has made it a forbidden and fascinating realm where nature's beauty conceals a deadly secret. Boiling Lake Found in Dominica's lush Morn Trios Pittens National Park, the Boiling Lake isn't your average hiking destination, but a bubbling cauldron of nature's fury. This otherworldly marvel is the second largest hot spring in the world, maintaining a scorching temperature of around 200 degrees Celsius, 392 degrees Fahrenheit. The lake's elusive charm lies in its ever-changing appearance, shifting from a serene pool to a roiling, steaming pot. Don't let its alluring beauty fool you. Venturing too close can be precarious. Hidden gas vents release toxic fumes, and the lake's unpredictable boiling state poses a risk. It's nice and hot, so whenever we walk in through here, we have to be careful with where we step. Nature's drama unfolds here, and it's a reminder that even the most enchanting landscapes demand respect and caution. Chernobyl The infamous nuclear disaster site Chernobyl sits frozen in time as a haunting reminder of human miscalculation. In 1986, a reactor at the Chernobyl nuclear power plant in Ukraine went haywire, releasing a catastrophic amount of radioactive material. Explosion. The fallout spread far and wide, leaving an eerie ghost town in its wake. The danger lies in the invisible menace of radiation. It disrupts the very fabric of life, causing cancer, birth defects, and long-term health issues. Even today, the site remains off-limits for extended periods due to the persistent radiation. Chernobyl stands as a testament to the delicate dance we play with technology, underscoring the potential consequences of our missteps. Queen's Bath
As beautiful as it might seem, this is actually one of the most dangerous natural bathtubs. This natural wonder carved into lava rock attracts visitors with its crystal clear waters and stunning views of the Pacific Ocean. Located along the rugged coastline of Princeville on Hawaii's Kauai Island, Queen's Bath is a picturesque tidal pool where the tidal of the waves tend to shift from low to high and high to low in a matter of seconds. With the slightest mistake, even the most seasoned swimmers or lifeguards are at risk of drowning with such a dynamically changing tide. Tragically, numerous accidents, injuries, and fatalities have occurred due to waves sweeping over the lava shelf. The Bolton Strid The Bolton Strid, nestled in Yorkshire's serene landscape, might seem like an idyllic stream at first glance, but its innocent appearance masks a deadly secret. It looks safe, it looks tempting, and it'll kill you. Dubbed the most dangerous stretch of water in the world, this seemingly peaceful river transforms into a perilous force. The Strid's narrow channel belies its deceptive depth and powerful currents, claiming lives with its swift undertoes. It is the most dangerous stretch of water anywhere on Earth. Beneath its picturesque facade lies an abyss that earned the Strid its notorious reputation. Venture too close and the seemingly harmless waters can swiftly drag you into their unforgiving depths. Local lore warns that even strong swimmers succumb to the Strid's hidden dangers, making it a beautiful yet treacherous natural wonder. Anyone who's ever fallen in has never actually been recovered. Ramry Island. Situated in the Bay of Bengal is the Ramri Island, which looks like a tranquil paradise at first glance. But don't let its serene appearance fool you. This seemingly harmless spot holds a dark secret. It's renowned for its dangerous habitat, the saltwater crocodile. As the largest living reptiles on Earth, these creatures lurk in the mangrove swamps surrounding the island, making any venture onto its shores a risky proposition. The danger hit the headlines during World War II, when the Battle of Ramri Island Island unfolded. And escaping Japanese soldiers faced not only enemy troops, but also the treacherous crocodile infested waters. Today, Ramry Island stands as a cautionary tale, reminding us that beauty can sometimes conceal unexpected threats. The Great Blue Hole The Great Blue Hole is a massive underwater sinkhole that attracts both divers and nature lovers. It is located off the coast of Belize. This natural wonder spans 300 meters in diameter and plunges over 120 meters into the depths of the Caribbean Sea. Its mesmerizing azure hue and vibrant marine life make it a diver's dream destination. However, beneath its captivating beauty lies a potential peril. The Great Blue Hole's depth poses challenges even to experienced divers, requiring advanced skills and preparation. Rapid depth changes strong currents and the allure of of exploring its mysterious depths make it a risky venture for the unprepared, earning it a reputation as a challenging yet alluring dive site. Underwater Waterfall Ever heard of the riveting underwater waterfall? Well, it's not your typical cascade of water. It's a mind-bending optical illusion found in places like Meritarius and Antarctica. The sand and silt on the ocean floor create the illusion of a waterfall beneath the water's surface. It's like Mother Nature playing a trick on our eyes. But hold your snorkels. While it's a stunning spectacle, diving into the underwater waterfall is a big no-no. The optical illusion is just that, an illusion. Attempting a descent can lead to deep sea trouble. Strong underwater currents are the real deal, pulling you into the abyss. So admire this natural wonder from a safe distance and leave the underwater acrobatics to the fish. Deadly Sahara Oasis In the southwestern Libyan desert, there's an oasis that may not be the relief of a weary traveler hopes for. The water in this oasis is exceptionally salty, intensifying as it evaporates. 
It harbors insects, making it potentially harmful if consumed. Interestingly, birds migrating from Nigeria to Europe use this oasis strategically. They feed on the insects, which have a natural water purifying ability. While the oasis is not a source of fresh water, it serves as a vital stopover for these birds. The water here is nearly five times saltier than the sea, cautioning travelers against expecting a quenching thirst. Uguzu Falls Situated between Argentina and Brazil, Uguzu Falls is a breathtaking natural marvel that attracts both nature enthusiasts and thrill seekers. With a staggering 275 individual falls spread across nearly two miles, it's a spectacle that leaves visitors awestruck. However, beneath its beauty lies a potent force that commands respect. Its sheer power can be dangerous. The tumultuous currents and the force of the water pose risks for those who venture too close. Slippery rocks and unpredictable weather add to the challenge. While the falls are undeniably bewitching, caution is key. Nature's grandeur demands reverence, reminding us that even paradise has its perils. Sudanese Titu Island Sudanese Titu Island is a place that is teeming with natural beauty and a unique danger. Crocodiles! <laughs> Positioned in the Nile River, this island boasts lush landscapes and fascinating wildlife. However, it's not all tranquility. The waters surrounding Tutu Island are home to some rather unwelcoming residents, crocodiles. These stealthy predators lurk beneath the surface, making swimming or even a casual stroll along the riverbanks a risky affair. <laughs> Locals and seasoned visitors know to tread cautiously, respecting the coexistence with these ancient reptiles. So, while the island may be enchanting with its picturesque scenery, it's crucial to keep your wits about you. After all, you wouldn't want to be on the crocodile's menu during your island's escapade. Frying Pan Lake Frying Pan Lake in New Zealand's Waumangu Volcanic Rift Valley stands as the world's largest hot spring within Echo Crater. And this is the largest hot spring in the world, Frying Pan Lake. The water, quite acidic, maintains temperatures between 50 to 60 degrees Celsius. Contrary to its steamy appearance, the lake isn't boiling. It releases steam as hydrogen sulfide and carbon dioxide gas rise to the surface. Born in 1886 after Mount Tawari's massive volcanic eruptions, the lake showcases several craters. Despite being fed alkaline water with a pH of 8.2 to 8.7, the lake's average pH level remains low at 3.8. This geological marvel reflects the enduring impact of historical volcanic activity. Cape Tribulation Beach. Situated in the heart of the Daintree Rainforest in Australia is a tropical paradise that marries lush greenery with pristine shores. Cape Tribulation Beach. Beneath its breathtaking beauty lies an undertow of danger. The waters here are notorious for strong currents and box jellyfish, making swimming risky. Crocodiles lurk in nearby estuaries, adding a wild edge to the serene landscape. While the scenery is postcard perfect, caution is the unspoken rule. Visitors should revel in the beauty from the safety of the shore, respecting the untamed nature that makes Cape Tribulation an awe-inspiring, yet potentially hazardous destination. Champagne Pool a captivating natural marvel. Champagne Pool is tucked away in the Wahoo Tapu Geothermal District of New Zealand. Its boiling waters and vivid colors enthrall tourists. This hot spring boasts a kaleidoscope of hues, ranging from orange and green to vivid blue, creating a visually stunning spectacle. 
And in contrast to the green and blue of the water, it's a pretty amazing. However, beneath its enchanting facade lies a potential danger. The pool's striking appearance is due to its high temperature and a cocktail of minerals, including silica and gold. But unlike just normal champagne, this champagne also has this rim made of sulfur and all sorts of other minerals. With temperatures reaching up to 74 degrees Celsius, 165 degrees Fahrenheit, a dip in champagne pool would be more like a scalding bath. Visitors are advised to admire its beauty from a safe distance, as the alluring exterior conceals the risk of severe burns. Hanuakabi Beach Trust me, this isn't an incoming tsunami. This is Hanawaki Beach, which has dangerously powerful waves, strong rip currents and high tides that wash away the sandy shoreline. Since there are no major reefs to hinder potent ocean currents, in the clip you can see with such wild currents, it is certainly not safe for even the best swimmers or surfers. And this makes it a popular tourist attraction spot. It is located in the Hawaiian island on Kauai's Na Pali coast and is approximately two miles in length. I guess it's better to just enjoy the view from a distance. Mount Washington. Weather phenomenon. The National Weather Service says that the troposphere could dip below Mount Washington. Mount Washington, a legendary mountain known for its harsh weather and inherent danger, is found within the White Mountains of New Hampshire. I'm wearing like 60 layers right now. I've got two pairs of pants on, three. Dubbed the home of the world's worst weather, its summit boasts record wind speeds of 231 miles per hour. Unpredictable weather changes are the norm, with sudden temperature drops and fog reducing visibility. Hikers and climbers navigating its steep slopes face challenges, ranging from icy trails to sudden storms. The convergence of unpredictable weather patterns, low temperatures, and high winds makes Mount Washington a perilous adventure. It's a stunning testament to nature's power, demanding respect and preparation for those who dare to conquer its heights. Reunion Island Reunion Island, stationed in the Indian Ocean, is a captivating destination, known for its lush landscapes and volcanic wonders, boasting a mix of French and Creole cultures. It's a melting pot of flavors and traditions. However, despite its beauty, Reunion Island is not without its risks. The island's active volcanoes pose a threat, and occasional eruptions demand vigilance. Additionally, its rugged terrain and unpredictable weather can make outdoor activities hazardous. The prevalence of shark attacks along its coast has led to swimming restrictions. Travelers must balance the allure of Reunion's natural beauty with a keen awareness of its potential dangers. Why this tiny little island had so many shark attacks? ensuring a safe and enjoyable experience. Nutty Putty Cave With a history as captivating as its passageways, Utah's Nutty Putty Cave is more than just a typical caving destination. Seasoned cavers are drawn to this 1,400-foot labyrinth of precipitous drops and tight squeezes. Okay, here we go. The Nutty Putty Cave. Its attraction is not without peril, though. The cave has been placed on the risk radar because of its reputation for having an unstable structure. There have been terrible events in the past when explorers were trapped by its complicated arrangement. This is an adventurous but potentially dangerous experience because of the tight turns and difficult terrain. There we go. Let me back up a little bit. Which call for extra caution. Accessing Nutty Putty Cave necessitates expertise, readiness, and a profound regard for the harsh environment of the cave. Fatalafu River in addition to being a beautiful stream, the Fatulafu River is the untouched Patagonian region, providing nature lovers with an unforgettable experience. The river provides top-notch whitewater rafting and kayaking adventures, with its crystal blue waters slicing through breathtaking scenery. Though the Fatulafu is one of the world's most dangerous rivers due to its strong Class 5 rapids, its beauty belies a tough obstacle. 
navigating its waters is a nearly impossible task because of its swift currents, chaotic whirlpools, and enormous waves. For those who want to navigate the thrilling but dangerous rapids of the Fudalafu, safety gear and knowledgeable guides are essential. Anthrax Island Officially known as Grunard Island, Anthrax Island sits off the coast of Scotland with a dark history. In World War II, it became a testing ground for biological warfare, particularly anthrax. On the third day after exposure, the casualties begin. Dead sheep can be seen. The British military conducted experiments, leaving the island contaminated and uninhabitable for decades. Anthrax spores linger in the soil, posing a potential threat to humans and animals. The island was only declared safe in the 1980s after a massive decontamination effort. So it was decontaminated in the 1980s. It's now safe. Even today, signs of its dicey past remain. While Anthrax Island is a chilling historical relic, venturing there without precautions could expose one to the lingering danger of biological warfare remnants. Mermine Mermine is nestled in eastern Siberia, Russia, and holds the title of the world's second largest excavated hole, spanning 3,937 feet in diameter and plunging 1,722 feet deep. This diamond mine is an engineering marvel. Despite its awe-inspiring size, Mir Mine is not a tourist destination due to its hazardous nature. The extreme depth and harsh Siberian climate makes the site dangerous. Unpredictable weather, icy conditions, and the risk of rock slides contribute to its dangerous reputation. Even though the mine is no longer operational, its immense scale and challenging environment emphasize the formidable forces of nature and human ambition at play in the heart of Siberia. Hiveria Geothermal Area Iceland has a fascinating yet dangerous natural wonder called the Hiveria Geothermal Area. Imagine a surreal landscape painted in vibrant hues of red and orange with bubbling mud spots and hissing steam vents. It's like stepping into another planet, but tread carefully, as this otherworldly beauty conceals potential hazards. The ground is a patchwork of brittle crust covering boiling hot springs, making it a risky venture for the unwary. Sulfurous fumes permeate the air, adding a pungent aroma to the experience. Venture too close and the ground might betray you, giving way to scalding geothermal activity. Nature's marvels come with a cautionary tag here. Admire from a safe distance. Gates of Hell as devilish as the name might seem, the Gates of Hell in Termekistan are a surreal and eerie natural wonder. Imagine a massive crater perpetually ablaze with flames, lighting up the Karakum Desert since 1971. Somewhere around 1970, a sinkhole collapsed, either naturally. Originally a Soviet drilling mishap, the fiery pit releases a constant stream of natural gas. Soviet authorities decided the best way to get rid of that gas was, was drilling for oil, and methane gas started spewing out. While its alluring glow attracts adventurous travelers, it's crucial to note the danger it poses. The site's unstable ground and the potential for gas leaks make it a hazardous environment. Despite its captivating allure, visitors must exercise caution as the gates of hell live up to their ominous name. Turns in a pitchfork in the tail of the whole world. I totally understand how it got the name Gateway to Hell. Blending natural beauty with an element of risk. Mindenhall Ice Caves. Deep within Alaska's Tongass National Forest lies a captivating wonder known as the Mindenhall Ice Caves. Carved by the Mindenhall Glacier, these crystalline caverns boast breathtaking blue hues and intricate ice formations, making them a photographer's dream. It feels like you're under the ocean. However, their beauty comes with risks. 
The caves are in constant flux due to the glacier's movement, creating unstable conditions. Melting ice and shifting structures make navigating the caves unpredictable. Sudden collapses and falling ice pose significant dangers to adventurers. Despite their allure, the Mindenhall Ice Caves demand caution and respect for nature's power. Exploring them requires expertise, proper gear, and awareness of the ever-changing environment to ensure a safe and unforgettable experience. The Tasingi di Bamera Tasingi di Bomera, found in Madagascar, isn't your typical walk in the park. The name Tasingi translates to where one cannot walk barefoot. And for good reason. This otherworldly landscape is a vast expanse of jagged limestone formations, resembling a stone forest. There are towering needles and razor-sharp ridges that make navigating treacherous. The Tasingi isn't just a geological wonder, it's a natural fortress that can cut through skin and bone. Venture off the beaten path, and you're in for a risky scramble. One wrong step could lead to slips, falls, and unwelcome encounters with its unforgiving edges. Tasingi di Baramara demands caution. It's a breathtaking beauty with a bite. Runnet Island A tropical paradise at first sight, the Runnet Island in the Marshall Islands is actually hiding a deadly threat. Most well known for the enormous concrete structure known as the Runnet Dome, which was constructed during the Cold War to house radioactive waste from nuclear testing. This cactus dome, as it is commonly called, contains radioactive waste that is extremely hazardous to the environment and human health. Fears of leaking and contamination have been raised over the structural stability of the dome. Though the island itself is beautiful, Runnet serves as a warning about the long-lasting effects of human activity on seemingly perfect places due to the dark past of nuclear testing. The Mariana Trench The Earth's deepest point is at the Mariana Trench, which is nestled in the western Pacific Ocean and plunges over 36,000 feet. It's like the Grand Canyon, but underwater, just way deeper. Imagine a place so dark that sunlight can't penetrate, and the pressure is mind-boggling 1,000 times that at sea level. The trench is a hotbed of mysteries and wonders, hosting bizarre creatures adapted to extreme conditions. However, its allure comes with danger. The crushing pressure poses a peril to submarines, and the isolation means rescue is nearly impossible. It's an otherworldly realm where exploration demands cutting-edge technology and nerves of steel, making the Mariana Trench both captivating and intimidating. Devil's Bath Pool Nope, you won't get any superpowers from this pool, but only melt. Located in Watuapi, New Zealand, Devil's Bath is a green sulfur lake that may look like one of those animated toxic dump sites, but this light green pool formed naturally. The bright green color that the water has come from the deposits of sulfur that move to the surface and remain afloat on top. The bright color signifies active minerals while other hues are found around the area. Scientists and experts are still trying to find the origin of this natural wonder. Since the colors look so delightful, it is an ideal spot for most tourists at a safe distance from the vapors of the pool. Malu Su Nestled in the heart of Kazakhstan is a place called Malu Su, which may seem serene, but beneath its scenic exterior lies a dangerous secret. This quaint town is home to one of the world's largest uranium waste dumps, a legacy of Soviet-era mining. The danger lurks in the form of radioactive contamination, posing a threat to both the environment and human health. The aging infrastructure and lack of proper containment measures make Malu Su a potential disaster zone. Despite efforts to address the issue, the ticking time bomb of radioactive waste continues to raise concerns. It's a reminder that even in seemingly idyllic places, hidden dangers may linger. Salstroman Maelstrom Salstroman Maelstrom is a spellbinding natural phenomenon situated in Norway earning its stripes as the world's strongest tidal current. 
colossal whirlpools churning through a narrow strait, reaching speeds of up to 22 knots. What makes it a thrill and a chill? Gigantic volumes of water squeeze through a bottleneck, creating vertexes up to 10 meters in diameter. The danger lies in its powerful currents, capable of swallowing boats whole. Navigating these turbulent waters demands serious skill. Misjudge it and you're caught in a watery dance with Neptune. Salstrom's beauty is matched only by its raw power, a reminder of nature's awe-inspiring force. Overton Bridge The Overton Bridge, tucked away in the picturesque landscapes of Scotland, this bridge carries an eerie reputation that extends beyond its charming facade. Built in 1895, this arching structure spans the Overton Burn, connecting the village of Milton to Overton House. However, what makes it notorious is the inexplicable phenomenon of dogs leaping off it. Dubbed the Dog Suicide Bridge, over 50 canines have taken fatal plunges. Theories range from supernatural forces to sense attracting them, but the mystery remains unsolved. Some speculate it's the eerie atmosphere or the unusual architecture that disorients animals. Rather due to paranormal forces or simply a canine conundrum, Overton Bridge continues to mystify and caution visitors. Australian Outback The Australian Outback is a vast region of unirrigated land that spans 5.6 million kilometers and covers more than 70% of the Australian continent. As eager as you might be to go on and explore this infinite wilderness, I would suggest you take a step back as this piece of land is crawling with danger. Literally! From desert scorpions to thorny devils, and of course, one of the world's largest venomous snakes, King Brown Snake, resides here. Travelers often get lost and are reported to be bitten by these and many more deadly creatures. Dehydration due to extreme heat, lightheadedness, and even heart attacks are common if you're lost for too long in this unforgiving land. Oi Mayakin! If you're upset about your hometown being too cold, all your complaints are going to go away once you get to know about this village. Oymyakin is a royal locality in Oymyansky district of the Saka Republic, Russia, where winter temperatures average minus 58 degrees Fahrenheit. That's minus 50 degrees Celsius. The remote village is generally considered the coldest inhabited area on Earth. This makes day-to-day -day life very difficult for its inhabitants and even simple tasks such as going to school, drying clothes, drinking water, and even going to the washroom become troublesome. Frostbites due to extreme weather are a common occurrence here, so always be caution if you happen to visit this snow land. It's time for today's open discussion. This picture was taken in October 2019 of red sap that was coming out of a bloodwood tree in northeastern Africa. This sap comes out of trees whenever they are cut down or broken off to coagulate and seal wounds just like human blood. They have numerous herbal uses to cure diseases like malaria, ringworm, and many more. However, it has to be extracted carefully as too much of this fluid can end up killing the user. It dries up to turn into a rubber-like paste, which can also result in a rookie ending up getting stuck and expiring. Thank you very much for watching the video. Do like and share it with your friends. Subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon to not miss any of the upcoming amazing videos. Thank you once again.